I mean, you know, ranging from the bomb uh, or missiles, ranging from about 22,000 right up to the cruise missiles at uh, around three quarters of a million pounds per, per pop, as it were. And so, understandably, the people involved in those industries, uh, you know, are cashing in. And they are very influential, regrettably, on the political scene. And uh, I think it was you, Jyoti, that called into question the suitability of our democracy. You're absolutely right. It's a passion of mine. I think de representative democracy totally failing us because the representatives that we have in the Houses of Parliament are not representing the people that elect them, in my opinion. They are representing the lobbyists. They're representing the military industrial complex. How can it be that we are saying that we're, you know, jobs are reliant upon the kind of arms industry? I mean, Britain is, I think, the second biggest arms exporter in the world. And I think Saudi Arabia is the biggest client of those arms exports. It is an absolute disgrace. And it's something that it's really important, I think, that we bring this to the attention of the people because there are alternatives to uh, building weapons of war. And we know that from the work that was done by the uh, Lucas uh, shop steward combine as long ago as 1976.